Hey, what is up, guys? Happy Pokemon TCG here, and in today's video, guys, we're actually doing something extremely random. We're going to be combining my two favorite Pokemon into one deck. Now, if you guys don't know what my favorite Pokemon are, then you can just easily take a look at my logo and tell that I really like Blaziken and Caterpie. So, these are the two Pokemon that I'm going to be picking out for this deck, and these two have nothing to do with each other. Um, completely random, and I figured, why not? Let's do this. So, Let's take a look at this monstrosity that we have. Oh my god. Okay, so it looks like we have a Ho-Oh with the purifying fire ability. And we do run fire energy, I know that. If we don't run fire energy, there's something wrong here. But we, we can't even attack with this thing. Uh, we don't have electric or water. Uh, we can attack with Kangaskhan. I think there's like a... Yeah, there's a 3-2 Kangaskhan in here, so that's awesome. And there is my number one overall favorite Pokemon, even though I have major love for Caterpie. absolutely love that little thing. But we uh, have the bad boy Blaziken in here with the Fist of Focus attack. Attach an energy card from your discard pile to this Pokemon. And then Flare Storm for 4 energy. Uh, flip a coin for each fire energy attached to this Pokemon. This attack does 20 more damage for each heads. So, not the best card. They usually never release a good Blaziken. Uh, there hasn't really been one for quite some time now. So, yeah. Then we have two Charizard in here. Charizard can come in handy with the wing attack if we can get it set up. We actually don't run any Blacksmith for some reason. I don't know why that wouldn't be in here. And then we have Embor uh, with Spiral Pulse. This is pretty much just like a watered down Charizard, in my honest opinion. Spiral Punch, flip a coin until you get Tails. This attack does 20 more damage for each head with the base of 20 so for 2 energy you're doing about 20 damage and then strong flare 150 discard 2 energy attached to this pokemon and charizard i think is better overall just because of the fact that yeah you do the 150 but then you have a 60 base attack to fall back on flareon is a really good card if we had blacksmith in here once they're determined before you attack you may move a fire energy card from one of your pokemon to this pokemon and then blaze ball very similar to keldeo ex's attack uh, 50 plus 20 more for each fire energy pretty cool there and then there he is the wonderful amazing Caterpie we have a 111 line of Butterfree which is really funny and then we have two Trevenant EX whoops yeah we have two Trevenant EX in here I'm not really sure why I guess to you know have a little synergy with Flareon but for different energy then we have four escape rope and four switch. I I don't know why we would need four escape rope and four switch, but you know, hey, I guess we're never gonna have anything stuck active. One target whistle because we totally run Lysander in here. Um, AZ and four Cassius. I didn't even know I owned four Cassius on this program. I'm not gonna lie to you. One judge, so we only have one way of shuffling our hand into our deck. And then, even so, we, yeah, we draw four. We have rough seas and no water or electric Pokemons. That's awesome. Scorched Earth, uh, thank God this is in here if I can draw it. Because that's really the only way we can even do anything, uh, drawing-wise. And then we have a Salt Vest. Um, yeah, Salt Vest. And then we have 20 Energy. We have 14 Fire, 6 Grass. So yeah, this is this is gonna be bad. Like this this is Oh god. Alright, well, I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Alright, so this is about to happen. You guys can tell I play a lot. I've been pretty busy lately. But we're gonna hop into a game here on Pokemon TCG Online. And hopefully we can get a somewhat decent gameplay if we can ever find an opponent. But yeah, sorry sorry the uh, Pokemon content's been kinda lacking here lately. Um I've been kind of having, like, I guess you would say writer's block, if that makes any sense. And right now I'm fighting plastic on some cold coffee that I can't get off. Damn it. Well, this is hilarious. Hey, we actually opened with it. Alright. So we're actually just going to straight up start with basically everything. But we do start with the two main Pokemon of the deck, which is Blaziken and Caterpie. Which is pretty funny. So it looks like we're going against, I want to say probably Manetric Garbodor. That's what I want to say. There we go. I got it, guys. 
I got it. Coffee is among us. There we go. Oop, my bad, guys. And I was right. Okay, so we're going to start off with a Flareon. Let's go ahead and play Scorched Earth. We're going to use Scorched Earth. Get a couple cards in. Now I'm actually going to screw with my opponent here a little bit. All right, you know what? You know what he's going to do? He's just going to send up that one. There's no point in playing that. Um, okay. Why not? Why not? Well, let's let's just let's just roll with it, baby. Screw it. Let's just roll with it. I well, hope you guys are having a good day. Um, I'm actually having another idea that I saw on screen when I was getting ready to do this little gameplay here. Uh, that I'll be doing probably tomorrow, but I'll go ahead and record it today. But thank you guys for being patient with me too, uh, with you know the lack of content. Really, the only thing I've been doing is like Call of Duty videos. But I'll definitely miss doing the Pokemon content. I've just been kind of having like writer's block, I guess. So, see an Ultra Ball discarding a Battle Compressor in a Water Energy set tells me that there's probably like a Regice or Articuno or something in here. One of the random water techs because there's like 10 of them <laughs> you see the setup ability for a total of five I think four or five but I wanted to do this random video because uh, yeah red ice I'm gonna just random video just because I don't know it just seemed fun all right see if we had a blacksmith in this deck we can like go for that 100 attack I just need to do like a fun blaze deck, just a random one one day before the rotation. Do like not even focus on the mega, just focus on um, flare storm. Run like some trick coins and stuff in there. That'd be funny. We actually get in. Little does my opponent know, like I don't have jack squat in my hand. But my opponent burned two shamans. Didn't really do much with it, but still, basically. I'm at a huge disadvantage. <laughs> You're a Kangaskhan. That's what's up. Alright, my opponent is kind of going off. Kind of. Oh, I missed what you got, homie. I missed what you got. The world may never know. But we do see an overrun. Hey, hey now. Hey now. You can cut that. Now little do you guys know that when you knock out my Caterpies, I go into a blind rage. So if you hear me hit the table and scream, that's what that is. We're actually going to be doing some damage here though. We got that Fist of Focus. And I'm going to be attaching this to Blaziken. And there we go. We got three energies on it. Let's go, boy. That thing scares me though. It's blue and I can't attack it. So that'll be wonderful. But there is a battle compressor. I want to say maybe that's what my opponent got with trainer's mail. I was too busy kind of looking at the discard pile to see what he was uh, actually getting. But I figured I would try to make my uh, sleeves a little pretty here. Pick the Mewtwo, or not Mewtwo? Excuse me, Mew generation sleeves. I think they're generation sleeves. I don't know. I share an account with my buddy, and he put them on here. Alright, well, chances are I'm going to lose this battle. I know how to Mega Evolve. I got this. I got this. Goodness gracious. <laughs> so basically, at this point, yeah, I can go for this. But the problem with that would be... Uh, okay. The problem with that would be is that's going down guaranteed next turn. And I really won't have anything to fall back on. But since this is a random video, and we're not actually like legitimately trying in this game, we're just trying to have some fun, provide a little entertainment. Now, I could do that, but that would just be ignorant. But you know what I'm going to do, actually? Yeah. You're not getting knocked out, little man. I'll protect you, Caterpie. You're my homie. Alright guys, Flare Storm. 
see if we can get it. I bet we just flop. Yep. You know what? We did 130 damage with an extremely random deck we made on Deck Wizard. I think that's a win. You know, I think that's a win. But we do see a Sycamore coming down from my opponent. And there's the Garbodor. Really, the only thing you're shutting down is that. Oh, see now? Come on. <laughs> Took away my little victory. So basically, when that thing comes up and just attacks once, I'm kind of screwed. Yep, that's not good. Oh, that's not good, guys. Um, screw you, Deck Wizard. Why is the Deck Wizard so bad? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what's up, homie? What up, homie? See, why? <laughs> why? <laughs> I, I know a lot I have two escape rope and two switch in my hand. I'm going to say throughout rotations, there are decks that have maybe ran two switch, two escape rope, but I, I want to say probably not. I really want to know what my opponent's thinking looking at my field right now. See, you're, you're, you're just taking away all that hard work. Huh. <laughs> um. Let's see. <laughs> Uh, okay, let's just let you. I know how to Mega Evolve, son. It's like, I know I'm bad at this game, but I ain't that bad. My field looks so random right now. By the end of this game, that Manetric's not going to have any damage on it. Can I draw a Cassius? Do you know how funny that'd be? Nope. Okay. Uh. I guess I'm gonna get something ready to attack. I'm just gonna play a judge. Why not? Yup. Okay. So we draw four. Oh, we of course we draw the AZ now. Uh, let's set up in board. There we go. I'm like getting the most random assortment of just absolute crap I could imagine. Like I'm not getting anything whatsoever. You see another Manetric Spirit Link coming down. All that damage I did is basically gone. Stupid rough seas. No, not my Mega Kangaskhan. <laughs> monster. You monster frisbee. That sucks. Okay. Um let's just bring well bring you up on that. Can I get an energy? Thank you. I'm really not able to do anything. Um this game has gone on longer than it should have. But tomorrow's video, I promise, is going to be a little more serious, uh, but not really at the same time. It's like, it's a serious video in my opinion, just something I want to promote in the Pokemon TCG. So if you guys are seeing this, make sure to stay tuned for that. We see a VS Seeker for a Lysander. I'm guessing my opponent is going to target my Flareon, just my guess. Oh, we're gonna target Trevenant. Little do you know. Little do you know. Can I get another energy, please? Please? No. <laughs> but, yeah. <laughs> yeah, take that. 
I'm not putting him down. I don't want him to get knocked out. I'm protecting you, buddy. I'm protecting you. It's okay. I want to draw my Cassius now. Like, I just want to draw Cassius, please. Nah, no. right, whatever. I'm delaying the inevitable at this point, guys. That's what's happening. Uh, let's see. Who could I bring up? Bring you up or not? I'm gonna make him work for it. All he needs is a VS Seeker. He's got this or another Lysander. Chances are he has it. There you go. All right, good game, man. Good game. I was actually wanting to draw Cassius. I thought that would have been pretty funny. But the deck wizard has failed us, guys. We have gone down in pretty convincing fashion. But if you guys enjoyed this extremely random video, make sure to like it and subscribe for some more extremely dumb content. And I do have a video coming out tomorrow if you guys are seeing this. And this has been on my channel for a couple days. Then that video is already up, but you are all absolutely amazing. Thank you again. And this is Epic Pokemon TCG signing out. Take care, guys.